So we were talking about finding the right shade of makeup, and this can be a big challenge, especially because there are so many choices. Mm -hmm. But there's something new that is trending, okay? And it's about self-adjusting color, uh, and they change, and there are all different variations of this, so let's talk about what this constitutes, okay? I like that, I like that, because finding the per perfect shade can be a bit of a challenge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so yep. thermal colors is what you call them. This is all the rage for nails, okay? All right, let's get and it. so this is about gel manicures. And you know, mm -hmm. gel manicures you have to cure with a UV light. That's but right. but you can still do this at home. So this is an example <clears throat> of the color changing. I, I'm I, I it's like I, I want you to like zoom in on this. Let me hold it for you. Okay. So you can hold the hand. Okay. The heat, you can, well, can you see what that's doing? How it's changing the color? Oh, it's, it's gotta be hot, that's okay. right. So it's not. Oh, okay, wait see? a second, what? Can you see that? Wow. Like, really changing. So wait a second, these went from reds to greens and blues? Well, and they're getting lighter and, see that? Oh. I just want to make sure that the camera can, can see that. Yeah. But yeah, you, you saw that, right? I saw it. Okay, so now let's take this. Now that they're all warmed up, let's dip it into ice water. Look at how dark they got. That's crazy. Is that a demo or what? That's a demo. That is a demo. Yeah, that okay. That is a demo. So you can get these thermal manicures, mm -hmm. and it will change, like, according to your body temperature, according to the room that you're in, according to going outside. That's why I thought this would be a good segment, because clearly there's a big difference uh, in temperature. Big time. You can have some fun with it. You can have yeah. some fun with it. Now, you also have some primers and highlighters here. What do these do? So this is about actual warmth, this is about the illusion of warmth. At this time of year, no matter what your skin tone is, you know, we tend to get a little uh, dull mm -hmm. or uh, ashy or, you know, drab. Or all of it. And so there are ways to impart warmth and that would constitute things like primers that have, you know, go, like um, a little bit of like a peach tone to it, mm. and it, you can add this to any color foundation, whether it, you, you know your skin tone is really, really pale, but even for like dark skin tones, this will add warmth, and it'll sort yeah. of correct any kind of dullness. You could use something that is sort of got shimmer to it. Oh. And again, these are, again, these are self-adjusting, so it doesn't matter what your skin tone is, you can see that they're sheer enough so that it will adjust okay. and it will add the idea of warmth. And warmth, and that's what we want because you do feel dull. You just feel like you, you know, you need some sun. Right, and so instead of going out and buying a new shade of makeup, you just adjust what you have with products like this. So do okay? you put this on top of your foundation or you mix it with your foundation? Be creative. Okay. Do it on top, okay. do it underneath, do it both. Okay. I don't, I like to break rules, you know that. Hey, that's right, that's okay. right. Okay. All right, so next we wanna talk lipstick that yeah. changes color. Okay. And then we're gonna bring in April and our intern, Amana, for this one. Come on in, ladies. Yep. All right, I'm John is ready. He's got here. mirrors okay. for you and everything. Well, the big mirrors for Tati because that's okay. in her right. <laughs> it's in her rider, so you you get the little mirrors here. But oh, look yeah, at yeah, yeah. look at these look at these lipsticks here. Okay, um, mm -hmm. we have uh, they seemingly look black, and these seem so. Let's go with the green ones, and these are self-adjusting colors. I'm not going to have you, you know, look like you have green lipstick on. This is going to individualize the color according to your body oh. chemistry. See how pretty that Those is? Pink. But it, oh, looks, it, is. it looks different per okay. individual okay. per I skin like color. <laughs> Amanda was like, hold on, let me, let me massage this in right oh, now. Let's oh, get full and, and so you could do that, you know, by itself. 
Mm -hmm. You could also put it over lipstick to change any lipstick mm -hmm. colors that are pre-existing. Okay. I like that. Let's cool. try the black, okay? Can they put that right on top? All right, we'll have just about 30 seconds, yeah, so go, go ahead and get into okay. that. Because we, a, a lot of times, you know, makeup is about layering things mm -hmm. anyway. Okay. So let me ask you this. If someone wants to try this trend themselves, mm -hmm. what do they need to look for in stores? So look for, when it comes to manicures, look for things oh, like yeah. the term thermal. Look for uh, self-adjusting okay. shades. Look for holographic. Look for, mm -hmm. um, you know, uh, uh, this one says ageless smart shade foundation. Smart. So, so smart makeup. Right. So there's all there are all forms of um, uh, products that will change according to your body chemistry or the temperature. They're even going to do this for automobiles. Oh, now that's going to be cool. That, like that. it looks good. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the, the color. future. It's great to live in in the in 21st the century. That's right. All right, coming up next, the valuable checklist that can help families everywhere care for their aging loved ones. We will give you that when we come back.